Hey, Jim here from K2 Concepts, shooting another how-to video. Uh, this is because most guys tend to have activation problems. Um, and you can, you can kind of use this whether you've got a spray gun for your activator or whether you're using an aerosol. Uh, we're going to use a spray gun. Aerosols are a little bit tougher to get consistent results but you can still use this technique uh, what we're going to show you here so we've got uh, our spray gun and activator activator gun it's a 1.9 ani and we've got it loaded up with water so what you're going to need for this experiment is um, you don't have to use a tank you can use a couple of saw horses if you want to but we set this up on our tank you'll see i have a two by four piece of wood Okay, you can get anywhere, it's, they're about 15 bucks, or you can cut your own for what you got laying around. Uh, two foot is about the size of a 50 centimeter film, so that's why I did two feet, all right? Uh, set it on top of the tank rails, and then I wrapped it with a piece of resin paper. Now the reason that we're using resin paper is because um, it'll reflect what your pattern is, what your spray pattern is. Also. Um, how much activator you're laying down, you can see when it starts to dry versus a piece of white paper. We used to use white paper, but it doesn't reflect well on camera. Um, the rosin paper or resin paper, whatever you want to call it, reflects a little bit better for what you guys are trying to do. So, we got it in the tank. This is about the size of a 50 centimeter film. Now what you're going to do now is work on your technique, how you lay down your activator, because I've noticed that that is a significant part of a lot of problems that we see on the forum. Lack of activator or too much activator, over activation. So, but we have to work on your technique. So if you're sure your gun is working correctly, your pattern is laying down correctly, now we need to work on your technique. So what we're going to do is grab the gun, set it up. I've got it about one bar. All right. So that's about 15 pounds or so, 14, five, whatever. So what you're going to see now, is you're going to be able, without spraying down activator, uh, some guys you can use acetone. Acetone will, will evaporate off the rosin paper a little bit quicker, but you're also shooting film fumes with acetone. So we're just going to use plain water, all right? So, you can kind of see what your pattern is like, all right? Now we're a little bit dry in here, so that means I, I need to, next time I'm going to overlap this a hair. Alright? And then you can wait for that to dry, or if you're going real fast, you know, if you're not laying down enough, then you can come back in this way and see what your pattern is like. And then you'll notice when they're really dark that you're laying down a little too much activator. Alright? And so that's an over-exaggeration of your technique. But again, once this dries, you can start all over again and work on laying down your activator. Now, once you make one pass, you can stop and then take a look and see if you're, maybe you're dragging, okay? You're not smooth. This is kind of, is basically like painting. It's all muscle memory. So you've got to get it going nice and smooth, okay? you got to almost not think about it. And you also have to read your pattern after you're going by how it looks. And we'll, we'll get more into that in another video at a later time. However, this is a cheap and easy way to start practicing how you lay down your activator and even your paint if you want to. You know, if you're, if you're laying down paint, crank it up a little bit. Crank it up to about 29.5 or 2 bar. And then you can start seeing just how you're laying down your paint and uh, so it's a good way to work on your technique without wasting materials okay so uh, that's it for this one uh, got to have a little corona for the haters because it is a little bit warm <laughs> oh that's good all right join us on the forum k2forms.com you can email me k2forms at gmail.com Questions, comments, leave them below. Like this video. Uh, we hope to see you on the forum, and I hope you're having a good day dipping. We'll talk to you later.